Chris Williams, San Antonio, 90.1 FM, your only alternative. This is your host, RC. You're listening to Live on KSWAM. And, uh, yeah, my last Live on KSWAM. Oh, whatever. Here in the studio with us tonight, though, we have some pretty awesome guys. So, you know, let's go ahead and meet them. Hey, guys. Hello, what's going on? Hey, what's up? Please, introduce yourselves. Okay, my name's Jason Thermiel. I'm the play guitar for Commercial Free. Uh, Joe Turner, I play drums. My name is Vernon, I play bass for Commercial Free. For Commercial Free, in case anybody missed that. So, hey guys, how are you doing? Doing pretty good, actually. All right, come on, <laughs> don't climb up now. You guys are all talk, talk, talk. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, we're, we're good. We're, I mean, I'm really psyched up to be here, and uh, I'm, I'm just, you know, pretty... We're getting a lot of shows lately, and I'm doing great. I'm trying to play the best I can, and do a good job, you know, for everybody out there. Yeah, you guys have uh, pretty much been all over the place lately, and you're continuing to go places. Um, one thing I want to touch on, you guys had a spillover show last night, and I just want to touch on it because right now it's spring break, and right now South By is going on, and then we have the spillover here in town, and so I guess the whole city is kind of taking part of it, and so you guys said you played with a band from Hawaii, and yeah. another band from L.A. last night. So I just want to get, I guess, from an artist's perspective, what was that like, just being a part of this in the city? Well, see, I've, I, I think as being as, like a fan and a fan-wise, I thought it was awesome because you get to see other acts from other places. And, you know, I, I guess it's kind of inspiring, you know, to see, see them do what they do every day and come over here and, and be so pumped up, you know. And I don't know. I think it's pretty awesome. <laughs> yeah, they had um, they had a lot of cool stories to talk, tell us too from the road trip on the way over here and heading back out to South by Southwest and all that. So it's pretty neat to meet somebody from LA, you know, uh-huh. and all the way on the other side from like Honolulu. Yeah, so you as a band, would you ever consider going out maybe that far, maybe out to Honolulu or all over Hawaii? Oh, yeah, that's one Definitely. thing we talked about. We talked with them about that, you know, getting their number and exchanging emails and Facebook and all that. So they have a lot of albums that they brought to us at the show, and you know, it's like nothing. It's something that we can go, you know, and record with them in LA. Is what we wanted to, you know, yeah. network. So. For sure, I just go for going to go see the sites and meet different people. You know, all kinds, all creeds, anything. So it's cool. So before we get ahead of ourselves, though, let's go ahead and I guess. Oh, excuse me. Give everybody a background about what commercial free is and how you guys came together and just where you are now. Okay, um, well, I, I guess we got together like in 2007. Um, I had, had different members at that time, but you know, things didn't work out too well. Um, but now I got new members. Uh, I've been with Vernon for about two years. We've been playing acoustic shows off and on, uh, here and there with drummers after drummer. <laughs> but uh, we, stayed, we stick together, you know, and I guess that's what matters. Uh-huh. Finding loyalty, and uh, then we came across Joe, and uh, we started playing with him maybe about a year ago. Yeah, the um, I had my own band too. It didn't work out as well, and I've known them for a while. I've been booking band, uh, shows with them, and it just seemed to uh, you know fit perfectly. Two guys without a drummer, and then me without a whole band. So I was like, well, let me just play drums for you guys. I've I've been playing drums for like five, six years now. I have a studio at my house. So I have like a lot of instruments: bass, guitar. guitar yeah, it was like know. destiny. <laughs> it was like oh, destiny. Was good, man. So, <laughs> what really took so long for you guys to get together? If you known um, each other for so long, what kind of made it, made it to where? I mean, you obviously knew each other for a long well, time. Y'all got along, and then I'm assuming you guys had the same kind of soulmates. musical, <laughs> we're soulmates. musical yeah, taste. We're soulmates. So it kind of uh, just worked just, out. Uh, yeah, I think it's just a natural thing of wanting to do your. You, know, you want to do what you want to do, uh-huh. and then you don't really accept, you know, what the world's trying to throw at you, and then it's just like, yeah, it's like going just your own path comes and along, you know. So kind of maturing as we go as artists, you know, and it's like walking with a very, very pair. Dark shades on. <laughs> yeah, yeah, so, yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, that's what I make you describe it. Then. And you're like, uh, let's just this just go with this and, and see what happens. So how was it that you guys settled on your sound? That's all, Jason. We uh, we're all fans of all that '90s rock, indie, alternative stuff. You know, that was my favorite. Like, uh, just can't escape it. It's so good. Yes, yeah, it is. So Pearl Jam and Smashing Pumpkins, and Nirvana. You know, I, it's just stuff. really great. And uh, that's like, you know, like I know you start like, oh well. It inspires you to play, the, but I try not to play like them. I just, you know, use what they, what I learned, your energy, and put it into what I want to play. And 
I think that's the best way. Hey, is hey don't forget about Dave Grohl, man. We, we all, <laughs> oh, yeah. No, we all love Dave Grohl. Dave Grohl's yeah. like yeah, our can't favorite Dave Grohl. Guy ever. The nicest guy in rock and roll. Yeah, sure. Yeah, for sure. Gosh, he's so great. But anyway, we're not here to talk about Dave Grohl, guys. <laughs> we're here to talk about you. But you know what? I'm super excited to hear you guys now because I, I played it so many times. I've had shows that kind of just veer off into the 90s rock. So let's go ahead and listen, guys. Oh, yeah. All right. Oh, yeah. So if you're just tuning in, we have Commercial Free here in the studio with us. They're going to go ahead and do a little set. So it's going to be awesome. Stick around. We're going to go ahead and leave you with some offbeats, though, in the meantime. So check it out. You're listening to Live on KSWAM. All right. And you heard them earlier here in the studio with me. Now stick around. We have Commercial Free about to do some songs for us. So stick around. You're listening to Commercial Free on Live on KSWAM. song called Gossy Films. It's commercial free. Commercial free. Yeah.
YM only minor slight effects. <laughs> Alright, All right, you can download this on uh, Reverb Nation, commercial free. This is called Say Goodbye. This is our new single from Coffee and Beer. Hope y'all enjoy, guys.
right, guys. This next one is called Sloth. Check us out. Reverb Nation, commercial free. Guys, we got one more for y'all. This is called Averse. We're commercial free. Download us, whatever, add us. We're ready. We're ready, book us. All right, here it goes. I could never be with you. 
Okay, it's William San Antonio, 90.1 FM, your only alternative. That was commercial free. Stick around. We're going to have them back here in the studio with us talking about where you can see them and get in touch with them and all that other good stuff. So stick around. We're going to have a quick message. Get right back into the music. You're listening to KSYM. KSYM San Antonio, 90.1 FM, your only alternative. And here again in the studio with us, we have the guys from Commercial Free. Hey, guys. Hey. hey. What's up? Thanks What's up? for listening, everyone, and all the support we're getting. Yeah, online. guys. <laughs> thanks for tuning in and streaming online. If you're not streaming online, if you're about to go back in your house, it's KSYM.org, by the way. But yeah, guys, thank you so much for stopping by. Um, if anybody welcome. really dug what they heard, um, there's a few ways to can get in touch with you. How can you, I uh, guess? You, get a, you can... Uh, Book us at uh, facebook.com slash JTP210. Or you can go to like reverbnation.com slash commercial free. There's uh, actually a free download there for the, the newest single. It's called uh, Say Goodbye. So, and we're going to go ahead and start working on a full length album and, and get that out to you guys as soon as we can. Awesome. And then, of course, there's always opportunities to see you guys around Live, town. Yeah. You guys have a St. Patrick's Day show coming up this Saturday. And then after that, you guys have after a show. That, we're really excited about playing with our good friends, the Offbeats, and then Elvis Cantu and the Baby Moons at Limelight that Friday, March 24th. Get there about 9 and catch all the bands. We're all really good, and we all, we're all really uh, good local musicians to come out and support. So. We're all fans. Yeah, we're all fans of fans of fans of each other. And we love y'all fans. <laughs> <laughs> but guys, no, thank you so much for stopping by. Thank you, Renee. It was a pleasure. You and are the um, best. thanks. So I guess I'll see you so out there. Your last show, okay? Yeah, my last show. Thank you. You so guys much. are my last awesome. guest, but I had a blast. And you guys totally rock. So thank oh. you for making my last show rock. Well, you are thank welcome. you. <laughs> all right, guys, have a good night. All right, if you want more information, we'll have it up on our Facebook page at facebook.com slash KSYM Live. And we'll also have our playlist up at the end of the show. So stick around. We have a lot more coming up for you. And we're going to go ahead and stay with the, I guess, local scene. So let's go ahead and hear some older Pop Pistol with Triggers.